two. Okay, Frederick Rousseau, um, who you should know uh, has audio engineering and sound design uh, credits on such movies as Blade Runner and Chariots of Fire, um, as well as 1492, also by Ridley Scott. Um, he's uh, developed uh, one of the AirCam tools is a plugin for Ableton Live called uh, Scrub. It's actually a, a Max plugin for Ableton Live. It's a Max, Live. and the collection name is AirCam Max. Okay. And just just show us. I saw this briefly, and this blew my mind. So show us what this can do. <laughs> Alors then. Um, I mean, the collection is seven different plugins, but I'm going to show you one named Scrub. So, and you can easily record a loop or any sound in it. And after that, you have the machine is going to divide in a certain amount of slicing. Okay? Then you can, after that, easily change you know, the rhythm and the way you are going to do it. And you are going to play them. Okay, let's say that I like this. So now, this is working in the audio domain, by the way. Yeah. So, no, no MIDI. Uh, the audio domain. Then you can, after that, you know, adjust. So it's analyzing the transients and the... Hello. now what we have... In real time. Here, you have now a pitch sequencer. That means I can... change the pitch of the sound. And I can have a sequence for the farmer too. Changing the frequency. And the third part here is a speciality of the air cam, is we call that remix. That means you can have only the transient, the attack. Okay? I can the transient. Yeah. I can take off the attack. And now I can have only the noise. Or only the sinus. Okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Then I can after that make a quick mix. Of it, and then I can mix it with remix the those elements together. Yeah, and remix with the original one if I wish. Um, a quick uh, second one that we have um, here um, that's called multi band delay. And, uh, let's say hop. Okay, one more time. That's the original loop. Okay, so now here I have eight different delay by bounds. Okay, then I can adjust it. And I can, you know, modify the delay of it, the feedback of it, and the pad of it, and the volume. Okay, then I completely change the rhythm of the staff. I can, I can remix, you know, with the original loop. That was the original loop. That's what I can do with it. Okay, and after that I can synchronize, and then the machine at each stage can go on different speed. Oh, so you can modulate yeah. the, the totality of settings in the and, and that's the that. product. Well, wow. and that's that's uh, we love these collections because we try to put on the market some original and innovative instruments, and we just want to have all the electronics player, all the guy making electronics music, having objects and they can really create something new. And this kind of uh, collection is fine. Is done for that. Is this on the market now, or yeah, yeah, it's on it? the market since the twenty fifth of, of September. Great. So it's it's called Earcam Max. Yeah, and it's Max tools. Collection One. Mm -hmm. And we prepare uh, Earcam Max Collection Two uh, just after the NAM show in America, beginning of February. Um, is going to be linked to uh, other kind of technology coming from the Earcam, and we start thinking about the Collection Three. Um, where we are going to make a special collection for helping composer. That means oh, okay. you play a melody and the machine is going to propose chords. Um, oh, well. Uh, or um, what we call uh, orchidees. That means you have a special electronic sounds, then you press a button and the machine is going to tell you what the orchestra, what the classical orchestra has to play to, um, to imitate these electronic sounds. Then we are going to put to work on this kind of uh, uh, collection with Ableton. And Ableton are using Max. We create Max at the Aircam in the 1980s um, with Mr. Zicarelli. And that's a, that's a really nice uh, bundle of uh, innovative company. Very, very good. We'll be, looking for the, we'll be looking for the new collections as they come out. Yeah. Thank you.